close a lot of cases, Burkhart. To what would you attribute this great success? It's kind of an instinct, I guess. Yeah. I've got an instinct, too. Mine is telling me you were involved in this. You think I killed your agents? No. We think you killed the other guy. Somebody did. And it keeps coming back to you. We've got a shell casing at the crime scene. And our agent's guns don't match it. You said you didn't wear your gun last night. That was pretty convenient. That happened a lot. I was at the hospital visiting my girlfriend. I didn't think a gun would be necessary. The last person Agent Kaniger called was you. If I could have saved her life, I would have. And it wasn't my idea to turn the case over to them. Federal crime, our jurisdiction. What did you know about it that you didn't tell them? All I know is whatever was in that shipping container was more than they could handle. Why? It's, it's instinct. Not good enough. That's all I have. And then there's the DNA. If it was mine, I'd be in jail. The DNA from a hair we found is close enough to yours to be a relative. But it's not yours. We want to know who you're covering for. My mother. Funny. Look, we have no interest in taking out a good cop. But we have two dead agents. You're trying too hard. Look, you've got your man. They're trying to connect me to this case is not going to bring your agents back. Ballistics didn't match. But that doesn't mean I think this adds up. 2314 to 2306. Suspect number three is in. Sure with him? Been following the damn truck for a week. Should know by now. Copy that. Truck. Ticks have six legs or eight. Twenty-three fourteen. Monk is westbound onto O'Donnell. Cheese Wag staff is on the way in. Also, there's a truck leaving. The one we saw back on the loading dock. I arrested Mr. Newman because I believe his ex-wife had reasonable grounds for her complaint. While we appreciate that domestic abuse is a very serious... Let me guess. My client didn't do it. You bet I didn't. Are you denying you went to Miss Jenkins' hotel suite to confront her about the lawsuit she filed against your other former wife, Nikki? I was married to Diane Jenkins, and the marriage ended in an annulment. She didn't get a settlement. Sounds like the basis for a very heated argument. And you're speculating. Did you throw this camera at Miss Jenkins? Does Diane claim that she was physically harmed in any way? In an abuse case, it doesn't matter. You know that, counsel. Miss Jenkins called 911 right after Mr. Newman left. She looked very shaken up when we arrived. He threatened, assaulted, and intimidated her. <sighs> Raspberry? Wow, strawberry. What? <laughs> Nothing, man. Nothing. Come on, man. We gotta get across town. Okay. This bitch is gonna tell you where there's construction. It's gonna tell you left, gonna tell you right. Pretty much blow you if you ask nice. This fucking detail, man. I hope we never catch this goofy motherfucker. <laughs> the officer. One got to jump in his dip, and the other one on the car tire. You feel me? Around the corner. Foot in the legs. All right. Thanks, man. Yeah. I think with all the money we're spending, we get some sushi or something. <laughs> yeah, Chicago Connection Adoption Agency. 10,000 bucks, you get cold coffee, a stale bagel, and a baby. Multicultural adoptions have been on the rise in the last 10 years. Shorter wait times and reduced fees have all played a key role. Reduced fees? Oh, why wait a year for a white baby when in you can pick up a six pack of black kids and way home from work? You think this is funny, huh? Time frames are difficult to the devaluing of black children. Calm down. It was a joke. I mean, why are you guys here? I need to get that stick up out of your ass. Okay. Here Let's get out of here. We encourage an open adoption philosophy in which birth parents and adopted parents have the I feel bad for the kid who ends up with you. 